Hey everyone, welcome to A Rabbit's Tale. My name is DJ Ear. I have never played Half-Life before. This is a, uh, I, I want to call it a mod, but it's sort of like a recreation. It's not quite like just a, an HD upgrade, as it were. There's been some things that have been changed around, I am told. But I've never actually played Half-Life. So, I don't know what I'm getting into. I'm not totally sure what this is all about. Really don't know what the story is. I, th I, I know that the aliens are involved in some way, and there is a crossbar. Cro crowbar. There's a crowbar. Um, but other than that, I'm, I'm really not totally sure what's going to happen, or what's going on, or who any of these uh, settings or characters are. So we know that it's called Black Mesa, um, which I believe is the name of the uh, place that I'm going to, because I have played Portal 2, so I know that I'm, I'm somewhere in the Portal universe. And, uh, see? Oh, I, I didn't grab a soda before I left, so that's going to be unfortunate. Ah, Black Mesa Research Facility in Black Mesa, New Morning, Mexico. And welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. Hello. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. Should I just should I sit down here? I'll the sit time down. The is 8:40. Probably got a long trip ahead of me. Current topside temperature is by Joe. 3 degrees with an estimated high of Anyways. 100 and This is a uh, this is a damn beautiful looking game right here. Black Mesa compound is um, at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. The, the, yeah, this this looks really cool. I imagine I'm going to get lost in all of this. So this is going to end up being really really interesting. Um what do some of these little thing, thingies on the door say Door release. Oh, we hit a loading zone. Alrighty. I haven't really done a whole lot, and we're, we're already loading the next part. So this this should be interesting. Okay. In event of fire, use hammer to break glass. You, use... That? Is that supposed to be a hammer? Inbound. Where do I get the hammer? Can I get a hammer at the level 3 dormitories? What? Jim, do you have a hammer? Oh, I'm on the Sector C line. The C line. Not the Fee line, but the C line. High security train? How is this a high security train? It's a couple of seats and some poles. There's no, there's no security guards. This thing's a mess. There's shit all over the place. No one's picking up this newspaper. Ooh, ooh. What are all these pretty things? Whoa, ooh, whoa. Due to the high toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, uh -huh. no smoking, eating, or drinking oh, wow. are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. Wow, this is really pretty. If this is all where I'm gonna get stuck in, I mean, that's not so terrible. This is a pretty nice looking landscape right here. I guess I'm supposed to be in New Mexico, so. You know. I was in Arizona recently for Arizona FurCon. That was pretty fun. Please keep your limbs inside the train at all times. All of my limbs. To open the doors until the train keep all of my limbs inside of the train. The How can you even call this a train? It's basically just a box car. It's hardly even a box car. To remain seated and await further instructions. It's it's like a half if tuna can. Necessary to exit the train. Disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Wow. Stay away from electrified rails. What is going on down there? Proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives. I don't know. They got a couple of porta potties. It looks like. Only two? That's that's hardly enough porta potties for a helicopter that big. You need like nine porta potties. Easily. There's just shit all over the place. 
I mean, I guess this is faster than, than walking, I suppose. Okay, so we made it to the big, the big door. Steve, you gonna open that door for me? Cool, thank you, Steve. Steve's cool. I like, I like Steve. But not on Tuesdays. On Tuesdays, Steve's an asshole. Because usually Monday nights, Steve has off. And he stays up drinking all night. What? What? What's going on? Oh, do I have to wait for the door to shut behind me? Yeah, we wouldn't, we wouldn't want me to get out. I'm a badass. I am dangerous. Ooh, more loading. So I guess we got one more loading zone, and then, uh... God knows how many more. They just keep coming. And it doesn't look like I'm anywhere near where I need to be yet. But, uh, hey, at least we're turning the lights on. Gordon Freeman. Male, age 27. That must be me. Look at me! <laughs> I've got a PhD, an MIT, and a theoretical physics. Those are, those are all pretty cool. Ooh. I am a research associate. You know, I worked at Costco for a while, and they called me a sales associate, and, like, that was my title for standing in front of a table for six hours and making food, so... Anomalous Materials Laboratories. Uh, AMR. Do you have a friend or relative who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Yes. Immediate openings are available in the areas of Materials Handling. Yes, little Jimmy would love to be part of Materials Handling. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. Yes, I will do this. Where can I where can I contact them? Uh huh. Biotechnology or other high tech disciplines. Please contact our civilian recruiting team. No, uh, little little Jimmy's not that smart. He's a bit of a dummy, but he loves handling some materials. You give me one of these. That would be cool. It's a cool little like. It looks like a it looks like a bug. It's kind of like a. Uh, a We're, we're heading this way. Heading into the fan. Oh, I'll probably go down there. I'm sure. That little opening didn't look like big enough to fit me, though. A reminder to all Black Mesa personnel. Oh, maybe the whole thing, the whole floor came out, so that's cool. Are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis right, well. or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. So this 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 game is in game. This like mod or whatever you want to call it is still technically in beta, although they're really close to releasing the full version. Um, but I figured now would probably be a good time to play this because I've never played Half Life. I've heard nothing but great things about it from everyone. Two has showed me a little bit of uh, the first Half Life, but that was a long time ago, and I barely even remember what it looked like. And I don't think it looked like this all that much. This is pretty this is pretty snazzy looking right here. Oh, this must be my exit. Cool. Alrighty. Stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify. Jesus, this is like almost a almost a ten minute opening. This is incredible. Be sure to check your area I don't remember when the first Half Life came out, but uh, I know it was a while back. And productive day. Well, all right. We, we almost got all the way there before we needed to hit one more loading zone, I guess. <laughs> and Morning, there we Mr. go. Freeman. Hello? Looks like you're running late. Uh, no, bullshit. You heard nothing. Yes, I'm running late, so if you could move faster, please. You know, Barney's been Can you... scarce around these parts. Hey, look at you walking all goofy. You want to walk all goofy a little faster? I don't care. Just uh, open the door. I have. I'm late for work, and I have to go right now. Talk with. What's some pep in that step, Freeman? Uh, what? Well, uh, screw you! Stop giving me shit. Oh, man, you cut the ponytail. <sighs> Jackass. Maybe I didn't like the ponytail. 
open the door and let me in. I am late. I'm late for work. At the anomalous materials section of Black Mesa Research Facility in somewhere in New Mexico. Hey, Mr. Freeman. Hey, what's up? I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm we'll still trying to find it. my files. Just one of those days, I guess. What, how do you have a system have crash with this old ass CRT too, computer? I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. A hazard suit? Showed, oh, you are having a bad day. You got a blue screens all over the place. What's this say? Sergeant Gillen. Report hmm? to Topside Checkpoint Alpha. Uh, I don't know. It says something. I can't quite read it. It looks silly. Uh, it's all over the place here. Are you checking your email on public servers? Damn it, Dan. I have half a mind to report you. What are you doing here? If this is anything less than a full-scale code red calamity, I'm not interested. What? Well, fine. I don't need you anyway. Okay, we'll just head down this way. And see what's going Good on morning, here, Doctor Freeman. Hey, how's it going? But the thermal protection system seems guys. to be now. Those TPS reports guys. are progressively worse. Anyone want to look at me? Acknowledge I'm here. Days. Yes, about that. We're going to need you to uh, come in this weekend. What? Uh, who's talking? Do you worry. both have the same voice? What is going on here? Next convention. Uh, bro. Would you look at that? Good morning, Gordon. Yeah, hi. What's going on? Anyone got... Does anyone know where I need to be going? Hev? Hev, do you know where I need to go? <laughs> Stacy, nobody likes your laugh. And everyone in the office would tell you that, except no one is going to tell you that except for me. Yep, yep, yep. There's a pepperoni pizza in my near future. Ha 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 choke on it. Uh are you gonna talk to me I now? Got this under control, Gordon. Well, it didn't look like it. What's this way? Who are you people? What are you doing here? You got a little like animated googly things on your laptop. The Where did you get a laptop? Why has everyone else here got CRT and you've got a nice ass laptop? That's that's ridiculous. I want one of those. Sector B, huh? Got the wrong airlock, Mr. Freeman. Oh. You know I can't let you through here. Oh, I'm sorry, Jim. It won't, it won't happen again. Uh. Hold. Hold on for one. I okay. We'll wait. We'll wait. Uh huh. Yes, yes, yes. The 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 formula for the the hottest hot pocket ever. Eh? You forgot to carry the two, or was it the three? Oh, you don't. You people don't know what you're doing. I'm gonna check the periodic table of elements, but we'll only check it periodically. So may, so maybe later. Well, okay, so nothing to do in here. Um, have I gotten this way yet? This is where I came with the. Okay, so we'll go this way. We'll see what's down here. You're living in the past. That yes, living in the past. Responsible for inspiring my career in science. No one cares about your career in science. Morning, champ. Hey. Hello. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Can I get me some soda? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Move, chair. I'm gonna get me some food. I'm gonna move this chair out of the way and get me some food. Ah! Alright, okay, cool. So we've got ramblers, uppercuts, naked fries. Oh, those, those sound pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna give me some... some Qua 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 quavers, quavers. Give me some quavers. Can and, you access uh, the mail server? What? What did you ask me? That's not my job. Uh huh. That's not my job. Ma accessing mail servers 
I'm trying, I can access the female servers, and that's about it. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? I don't know, because, because they look nice. And the company cares about things like Dread. how people look. No toilet paper. Oh, you're screwed, buddy. Uh... Ooh! Pick up objects, throw objects, drop objects. Hello. Can I... Hello. Can I pick this up? Get me some toilet paper. Oh, I got you, pal. Uh... Enter, throw objects. Excuse me. I might need to remap I'm that, I'm emergency. sure. Uh-huh. Well, um... Oh. Bro, I got you. Here, hold on. Don't panic, Harold. Don't panic. Uh, carefully. No, uh, shit. Hello? Hello? Bro, I got you. Hold Somebody on. Somebody get me some toilet paper. Oh, thank heavens. Holy I'm shit! I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. I got an achievement. Brownie in motion. All right, baby. Achievement unlocked. One out of one. Is that the only achievement in the entire game? That's awesome. Now, if that achievement thing would go away... Oh. Okay. Hey, maybe this is my hazard suit. Looks pretty sexy. Welcome to the HEV Mark IV protective Ooh. system. Okay. For use in hazardous environment conditions. Uh -huh. Automatic medical systems engaged. All right. Yeah. I feel really powerful right now. I don't know where to go. This music sounds way too badass for just putting on a suit, but, uh... I'm taking this with me. Can you use it to get through this door? No. Boy, they are putting everything online. I am coming online, baby. Here. You, you look like you could use some work. Work on this. What is that? I don't know. Alright, well. Let's head on down here, now that we got our little environment suit on. Guys, looking very nice. Go right on through, sir. Thank you, Steve. Looking good. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Yes, I am. Tell Janine I said hi. Uh, okay. The barrel. All right, well, uh, let's try going this way. Ooh, leadership. Black Mesa Research Facility is a worldwide leader in the field of fluid dynamics. Innovate! Our tram system is really cool! <laughs> oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. Is there some on the other side, too? When it comes to protecting science, this guy is on your side. Guy, security force, alpha, black mesa. Hello, Gordon Freeman. Hello, Mr. Guy. Let's see what this one says. Technology! We are the industry leader in- Oh my god, wait, what? Uh, 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 I've oft been told my left side was better. Well, maybe. I don't know, pal. Look at some knobs. These knobs don't do anything. Nope, nothing. I tried the knobs. The knobs, they, they lied to me. Lab coats are required. But ties are optional! <laughs> uh, okay, I guess we're going down here. Boy, we are just heading down and down and down. This guy's commute sucks. He's not even in a car and it's taking him over 20 minutes just to get to work. And I'm late! I slept in, I stayed up too, too late eating nachos and... And, uh, and pressing buttons. Did you catch that last fluctuation? It's nothing to worry about. Okay. Well, as long as it's nothing to worry about. Can I can I go through here? Great. Okay. Cool. 
Uh huh. Science, we good. We should harness the remaining photonic energy to ensure resonance control. Mm hmm. Yes. Double check the Brewster's plate's angles and make sure the superluminescent diodes are protected from optical feedback. Okie doke, can do. And increase the Flash Gordon noise and put more science things around it. What's up, Doc? Yes, hello. I am a wascally wabbit, thank you. Uh, well. Seems, Dr. Freeman. Hi! It's Freeman. Fremen. Dr. Fremen. You, you guys are just gonna keep pressing inputs, ain't ya? Just, just pressing inputs. Okay. You guys keep pressing inputs, and I'm gonna take a little break, and we'll have some more rabbit's tails tunneling lattice calculations uh, again? on the next episode. Stop asking that question. Shut up, Jim! I'm trying to say the goodbyes. Goodbye, everybody.